What's up guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my picks for NBA Sunday, May 13th. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss our new videos. Okay, this is for the two game slate on Sunday and Monday. We have the Celtics versus the Cavs and then the Warriors versus the Rockets. Okay, who do we have for point guard? I like Chris Paul for 9100 FanDuel versus the Golden State Warriors on Monday. Chris Paul has been on fire the past couple of games, scoring 67 and 58 fantasy points with a 33 and 31% usage rate. If you want to fade Harden, you should be playing Chris Paul, who's projected to score 42 fantasy points, which is just about five times value. Okay, everyone, it's time to announce the winner of the weekly comment contest for $50 PayPal. And the winner is Drew Winters. Drew Winters, you are the winner of this week's comment contest. Please reply to my comment in this video to collect your prize. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you want to enter the drawing for $50 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $50 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday night. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. Okay, let's take a look at shooting guards. Lots of good options at shooting guard. Clay Thompson, always a good play under 7K. James Harden at 11,700, and Jalen Brown at 6,700, who should be at full strength after resting his hamstring. With that said, I'm gonna go with Marcus Smart for only 5,400, so we can save some salary for other positions. Marcus Smart scored 34 and 37 fantasy points the last two games and only needs to score 27 fantasy points to get you five times value. Pretty confident Marcus will do that with his defensive plays. He gets steals, rebounds, and can get to the rim and score inside. Marcus Smart is probably my favorite value play on the slate, low risk and high reward. Okay, let's see who we have here at small forward. PJ Tucker went up to 5,800, so I'm not paying that price for him. I'm gonna pay up here for Kevin Durant at 10,800. KD has been the man the past two games, scoring 47 and 60 fantasy points. Durant is projected at 67 fantasy points, which is over six times value, and he only needs a few over 50 to return five times value. Okay, let's take a look at power forwards. If you have the salary, pay up for Draymond Green at 9,000, but if you need to go cheap here, have a look at Luke Richard Mahamute at 3,700. He's the only guy priced down, and you'll need to take a shot with some low salary guys to fit in the studs like KD, Curry, LeBron, or Harden. Mahamute played 20 minutes last game and scored 14 fantasy points. At 3,700, he'll only need about 15 fantasy points to return five times value. Okay, moving on to the center position. I think a safe play here is Al Horford at 7600. Al played 38 minutes last game and scored 43 fantasy points. Nice matchup for Horford against the Cavs who aren't that great of a defensive team. I wouldn't count on Aaron Baines having the same success he's had in the past couple games. And now with a price of 4400, I'll pay up for the more experienced pro. Al Horford is projected to get 35 fantasy points and only needs 37 to return 5 times value. If you want to try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video.